honestly don't even know what to say. The show wasn't necessarily that great, but the fashion was phenomenal. And that is what influenced me to buy these sunglasses, like for real. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Y'all, today I really wanna share with you guys some fabulous, fabulous sunglasses that I have been seeing all over the internet. And honestly, some that actually I was influenced to purchase because of television shows that I've actually been watching lately. So, if this is your first time here seeing my face, welcome new friend, I am Tasha Jade the owner of The Styling Tea, a channel that is dedicated to all things luxury and affordable fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So if this is the type of content that you do enjoy watching, go ahead and think about hitting that subscribe button right down there below. Go ahead and hit the notification bell so you're notified every single time a new video drops right here on The Styling Tea channel. And you know what, while you're at it, just hit that thumbs up. Just go on ahead and hit it so that way you know that you are going to continue to watch this type of content and it shows up for you on your inside of your feed and the algorithm keeps making sure that you are seeing my face. All right guys, so without further ado, let's just go ahead and get into these sunnies because I'm telling you, girl, they are fabulous. Okay guys, so I have quite a few pairs of sunnies that I really wanna actually share with you because I don't know what it is. I, I have been addicted to buying sunnies and in all honesty, I mean, I think it all has to do with the fact that it's warmer weather. I am ready to be out and about in the sun. So I wanna make sure that my sunnies are actually on point as well. So the very first pair of sunglasses that I actually was influenced to purchase was um, from Monroe Steel, from Fashion Steel NYC. And when I saw these, Girl, these sunglasses were just, like, I literally had to stop the video and go and buy these sunglasses because they were everything. So I picked up these amazing sunglasses from um, uh, Alexander McQueen. Y'all, these sunglasses right here are so adorable. And I, listen, I'm not a pink girl, but there are certain shades of pink that I actually can actually rock with. And that is these pair right here. Can we please just get into the sunglasses because they're so cute. These just give me like that 1970s Studio 54 type of vibe and I am here for these sunglasses. I just, I'm so happy that I actually purchased them. I did get them from Farfetch. If you don't know already, I am a huge fan of Farfetch. Um, I am seriously addicted. <laughs> I honestly am. But it's because Farfetch literally is the one place to shop to find designer goods at different prices that you probably may not necessarily find from other stores and to find items that you may not actually find in stock from other stores because they actually source from smaller businesses all over the globe. So it's kind of nice to actually find out that some of your items are coming from, you know, Italy or they're coming from France or, you know, even from Japan and so on. So you're supporting small businesses all over the globe. But the glasses come in like this nice little pouch, this black pouch right here, and it has a more of a magnetic uh, snap on it. And then also like any good pair of luxury sunglasses, it does come with a cloth um, to clean your sunglasses, which is fantastic. So these sunglasses are still available online and I will link them down below. So I'm telling you one thing right now, do not sleep on these sunnies because they will not stay in stock very long. So it means- Okay, so the next pair of sunglasses that I actually fell in love with, and I, I don't even wanna say I was influenced to buy them, but I guess I kind of was influenced to buy them only because they showed up in my recommendations, um, honestly, from Farfetch, but they are these Gucci uh, square framed glasses, and I love them. If you don't know anything about me, I love a good oversized pair of sunglasses. One, because they fit my face and they're easy to actually style. But here's what I love about these is that I'm really into color for the spring and summer. Like I'm really trying to venture into making sure that I'm like wearing pops of color. And this gives, gives me everything that I need in terms of highlighting all of the green trends that I really actually want. And I mean, Look at the frames, like look at how thick the green frame actually is. And I just love the shading on the sunglasses for my eyes. Like it's, they're just so cute. 
they have like this green or not the green but they have like the gucci logo here we go they have the Gucci, the Gucci logo right here on the side of the frames on both sides of them. Um, but they're very comfortable. They're very easy to actually wear. They are still in stock. Um, but this is what the, the sunglass case actually looks like when you actually open it and receive it. So inside, of course, it has like this nice blue lining. It also has a, a, um, a cleaning cloth that's inside of here as well. Um, and then it also comes with an additional cloth as well that you can actually use. So I, I, I love the fact that this is something that is Gucci basically put in a lot of um, extra attention to make sure that you are taking care of your sunglasses. But I love them. I honestly, I cannot wait for the weather to warm up so I could just start wearing them because they're just, they're just so cute. Okay, so if the last pair of Gucci sunglasses was not enough, I had to go and get another pair. I honestly did. I, like I said before, if you have not seen my um, luxury haul video that I actually did where I shared all of my Gucci finds, I will link it down below, but also I'm gonna share it right here so you can go and actually check it out because I did mention that I am becoming that Gucci girl. And it is true. I just, I don't know what it is. Like Gucci is just, they are selling me right now, but I picked up, I have been on the hunt for these sunglasses for a while and they went out of stock and then I finally was able to find them again. But I actually came across these sunglasses here from Gucci, which are more of like an aviator style. Um, I have worn these already once before, so I should have cleaned them before I actually, you know, showed them to you guys on camera. But these sunglasses are just stunning. Like, let's just get into the detail of the sunglasses. I mean, look at the gold trimming on the side of the sunglasses like even just right here on the front of the sunglasses these are just everything i think in all honesty out of all of the sunglasses that i actually own these have become my number one favorite sunglasses of all time i will def like i said with everything else i will link them down below for you they are still available and they're in stock they are a bit pricier than some of the other sunglasses that i have shown you so they do retail for around $580. But here's the thing, are they worth $580? Absolutely. Because I truly believe I am not only going to get my cost per wear, I'm going to exceed my cost per wear. Okay guys, so the next pair of sunglasses that I actually was influenced to buy are a pair of sunglasses that I actually found, I, I didn't even find them, I saw them on the show Emily in Paris and if you have not seen that show go watch it on Netflix just for the fashion alone. I say that because the show itself wasn't necessarily that great but the fashion amazing and it is because of that show that I fell in love with these sunglasses. So season two the fashion is phenomenal absolutely phenomenal but the woman who plays Emily uh, I think her name is Lily Collins she had on these pair of Valentino sunglasses and the moment that I saw them on her face, I fell in love. I immediately, immediately started searching the internet to find these sunglasses and I could not find them for a while. And then I just kept searching and searching and then I found them in stock on Valentino themselves. So they are these I don't even want to say, I guess you could say like they're like these cat eye sunglasses, but y'all, can we just get into the detail? Like how gorgeous are these sunglasses? The V trim right here on the side of the frame, the thickness of like the white all around the frame. And then let me just put them on. Let me just put them on real quick so you can see just how fabulous, I mean, there's no words. These sunglasses are just everything but they come in this really great um sunglasses case and it can as you can see on the front it says valentino um but it's nice and deep on the inside so when you open it up you see this um light pinkish reddish um, um lining on the inside and then the sunglasses sit nice and low um inside of here and this is what i this is the first time i've actually seen a, a brand actually make a sunglass case that's actually oversized um, so there's more than enough room for your sunglasses to actually sit inside of here. So these are still in, in stock on Valentino. Um, so I highly recommend you go and get them like today. 
Okay, and now for the very last pair of sunglasses that I wanna share with you guys. These ones I actually were not influenced by any particular person or any advertisements, but I shared these sunglasses with you guys in an earlier video where I took you shopping um, with me to the premium outlets in San Francisco or pretty much Livermore, and we found these sunglasses in Prada. So I wanted to share these with you again because they're so cute. I absolutely love, I love the round shape of the sunglasses. I honestly have been looking for a pair of round sunglasses for a very long time and I wasn't quite sure if I would like them. I think the reason why is because I really, there's a, um, a style icon that I have followed for a very long time. Her name is Iris. I can't remember her last name, but I'll share a picture of her right here. I love her sunglasses just for the simple fact of the frame and she's known for wearing these thick round sunglass frames and I there's just something about it I was like you know what? I really want to try it and I found them in the product outlet and I just fell in love so let me just put them on so you can see so the great thing about these ones is that even when I put them on they're not too round on my face they just sit perfectly maybe I just have a face that's like perfect for sunglasses I don't know but I haven't come across a pair where I'm like, oh, these are awful sunglasses. But like I said, I, I love these. I would wear these with a nice chic trench coat. Um, just like I, this, would, these sunglasses here would just be for like some really great chic style, something with like more of a classic look, just because I feel like on my face, they just give off that appeal. Like basically like rich luxe woman type of style, like dripping with money classic you know what i mean i hope that's making sense to you all right guys so that is it for the sunglass collection haul for today if you've made it to the end of this video go ahead and hit that thumbs up button right down there below the like button so that way i do know that you enjoy this type of content and if you have not subscribed to this channel please go ahead and think about hitting that subscribe button so that way you can officially join the styling tea community Hit the notification bell so you are notified every single time a new video drops right here on the Styling Tea channel. And once again, guys, thank you so much for tuning in for another video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!